sown by she amenable sabara of pai has branched and blossomed into 16 institutions of great repute and our canada high school association now in its 30th year of existence it has witnessed thousands of engineering graduates pass out through its portal over the years cec is proud to witness the transformation of young minds for one more such memorable occasion i cordially welcome mr arna papai a hearty welcome to mr yam ranath bhai honorary secretary of canada high school association
mechanical HOD is the most popular. Vote in the management. assembled every single engineer of CEC graduated in 2020. You have a huge responsibility, a commitment towards our institution to see that we get good uh, academic, uh, you will get uh, good uh, admissions next year. Please give grant to and ambassadors. Give you go and share your experience with CEC. Tell them you have gone through one of the finest engineering programs. You know, please, this is what I want to request you. And I also want to tell you, when you do well in life, maybe three years, four years from now. Come back to the college. Keep in touch with your alumni. This is what we, you know, being from the management side, I will mean, be here for the next one or two years. But you are here. You have got another 30, 40 good years of, uh, you know, your graduate life, your uh, academic, your uh, uh, professional life. So please come back and try to help our institution. Talk to your juniors. Tell them your experiences. Share them with them your experiences. Okay, tell them the do's and don'ts. That's the interaction with them. But I want you to. Next year, I want the alumni of Canada, early alumni, with the 16th year, to be the 10th. I want him to be the chief guest sitting here for the graduation day. This is what I want, this is the commitment that I want to give you. Please help us with our admissions to the college, with talking good about the college and trying to get a good admission. I don't want to say much. I wish to congratulate you, all of you, and wish you a very good life ahead, very good life ahead, and keep good day, good care of your parents. That is my request to you. I want to end my speech by saying, whatever you vividly imagine, sincerely believe, enthusiastically act upon, it should start A few words by complimenting and thanking your wonderful teachers who have uh, tried hard to choose it carefully to shape program elements into valuable elements, which are you people, who are today being gifted to our great country. I also compliment the management 
for offering such an excellent college and facilities to the students to learn and excel. Don't forget parents. I compliment the parents. So, say 16, it was all just kids out of uh, PU and uh, the anticipation on your faces was showing. But today, when you walked onto the stage, that confidence was really showing. And all the five, especially our Devadi, you really rocked. And that is because you had behind you the mechanical uh, students. You know, maximum uh, engineers on our learning body are mechanical engineering students, all from there. No, but the other fellows were not uh, bad. They were as good as you were. So congratulations. Uh, you know, you are a lucky generation. Maybe when you were uh, five years old, old, you could uh, navigate the Android. But you know, when we were small, if we learned the five uh, alphabets or A, 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 when we were four years old, we there was a jubilation in the house. The engineers, we did not to have and there are no computers. We used to carry our drawing board and do our drawing. Now I don't think any of those things are visible. No. Next, there is a batch of engineers who are pre-mobile and post-mobile. All of you are not in the mobile types. We never had communication facilities. The only way to communicate was to go and meet the person with whom you have to communicate something and come. And if you forget, again go and communicate with them. Today it is not so. Now again, there is one more classification. Pre-COVID and post-COVID in the US. So we are seeing, every day we are seeing changes and we are still learning. Learning continues throughout the life. I don't want to stand between you and the beautiful dinner that is waiting for you. I can speak in two ways. One is a short speech, not exceeding five minutes. The other one that I can do is one hour. I don't think anybody, any of you will like me to speak for one hour today and we will use that some other time. Now I wish you all a very great, grand success in your life and don't forget when you propose to get married, the hall belongs to camera. When the children are born, we have a monetary meeting for them. So we wish you all all the best. I'm sorry, Dr. Kirk. Graduates in all your thoughts and values, sir. Thank you, sir. On behalf of the Canada family, I thank the chief guest, Mr. B.H. Prasad.